On December the 17th, 2010, 49-year-old Nilo Vila was gunned down in the parking lot of his Hialeah apartment. Here's the case. December 17, 2010, around 6.30, our victim, 49-year-old Nilo Vila, was shot and killed during an attempted robbery. Around noon, he dropped his family off at the 79th Street Flea Market and went to go pick him back up around four. His wife and daughter were not ready yet, so with his infant grandson, he walked around the flea market until they were done, which happened around 6 p.m. Once they got to the apartment, they parked the vehicle. The ladies got out with the infant grandson, and he went to the rear of the vehicle to retrieve a stroller. Once he retrieved the stroller and he started to walk back to the apartment, he was approached by two black males. One of the black males had brandished a firearm, pointing it at, at him. The victim threw up his arms, at which point one of the subjects with the firearm shot one time, striking our victim in the abdomen. And uh, the victim, after being shot, stumbles a few feet behind him and is found by the police leaning up against the wall, which was behind uh, where his vehicle was parked at. We have a witness from down the street that once a uh, shot was heard, she turned into the direction of the apartment building and witnessed a dark-colored four-door sedan fleeing the area. Anybody with any information to help solve the brutal murder of Nilo Vila in front of his family, you can contact me directly, Detective Zorsky, at 305-687-2525. This poor man was murdered in front of his family, and police believe it was over a piece of jewelry. What a tragedy. Police have good sketches of these suspects. Take a good look. Both are young black males and they are believed to have fled in a dark four-door car. They may also frequent the Rainbow Flea Market where the victim was shopping before he went home. If you have information that could help detectives, please call Miami-Dade Crime Stoppers at 305-471-TIPS.